Hi guys, it's Nadi here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, a quick recipe on the open baked salmon, and this would go really well with the yellow beans and rice. So guys, let's get started. Guys, I have here my salmon pieces. These are actually two large slices of the salmon steak, which I've cut into smaller pieces. So I've rinsed this really well with cold water. I also squeezed half of a lemon and I've dried it very thoroughly. So the very first thing I've added one tablespoon of olive oil and I want to coat each piece with the olive oil. So I'm going to start by adding some onion powder. And I'm, I'm going to list all the measurement in the description box below. I'm going to add some garlic powder. I'm going to go ahead and add some smoked paprika. I'm going to add some basil, dried basil. I'm also going to add some freshly ground black pepper. And also I'm going to add some rosemary. And I like to break them up into small pieces and then put it on. I'm also going to add half of a Maggi bullion block. So now I'm just going to gently mix all this together and coat each piece with all the seasoning. So now I have my tray here. I've lined it with foil wrap only because, you know, it makes the cleaning process easier. So I'm going to place each one in here and I want to try to avoid um, having them touching each other, you know, just space it out a little bit. So guys, the very last thing I'm going to do here is that I'm going to sprinkle some all day seasoning on top. And I'm doing, I usually don't do this, but because I didn't let the salmon marinate, you know, I didn't have much time. So I'm, just to add flavor to it, I'm going to add the all day seasoning. My oven is preheating at 425 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm going to bake this at 425 for 20 minutes. So guys, after 20 minutes, this is what the salmon looks like. And I'm placing small pieces of butter on top. And this is going to give it a nice charred look. And it's going to increase the flavor. It's going to be so tasty. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this back into the oven at 475 degree Fahrenheit. So I'm going to increase the temperature to 475. And I'm going to give it another 5 minutes. So guys, after five minutes, this is what the salmon looks like and it looks so delicious. So right away, you want to cover this and let it rest for at least five minutes before serving. So in that way, it retains all the moisture and it won't dry out. So friends, this is it, the oven baked salmon and it goes really well with the yellow rice. You can check that recipe out and um it's a great combination so thank you so much for watching and i will catch you in my other videos take care now bye bye